former President Uhuru Kenyatta reportedly flew out of the country hours after handing over the instruments of power to his successor, William Samoy Arapruto, on Tuesday, September 13th. Welcome to Zafarani TV, a Kenyan online political platform where I talk about the Kenyan politics. If this is your first time to be here, welcome on board. Take a few seconds, hit the subscribe button, and give the video a thumbs up. The former head of state, whose 10 year tenure ended after Ruto's inauguration, proceeded on a vacation to contemplate his next course of action. According to one of his allies, who spoke to the media, said the trip was essential for Uhuru to relax and free his mind after the August Paul's aftermath. Although his ally did not disclose Uhuru's destination, it was reported that the former head of state went to a reclusive destination. Uhuru still managed to keep a low profile while vacationing. His ally, however, did not divulge if Uhuru traveled with his family or confidants. It is also reportedly that Uhuru skipped a Thanksgiving party organized by Azimio Laomoja presidential candidate Raila Odinga at Safari Park Hotel. And I quote, Uhuru Kenyatta skipped to avoid creating a perception that he's still in a campaign trail mode, the confidant stated. What is your opinion about retired President Uhuru Moigai Kenyatta fl flying outside the country after the inauguration of President William Samoy Arap Ruto abruptly? Please feel free to leave your comments down below. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to Zafarani TV. And thank you for tuning in to Zafarani TV.